Hey y'all, Southern Gaming Dude back here once again with some more of that Darkest Dungeon. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more content in the near future. So today we will be doing a well uh, veteran run on medium because I like this trinket. I like the extra speed and dodge. I don't really mind the, the negative stun and move resist. Anyways, it's my favorite reward today, so we shall be doing that. And we're also pretty low on money, so this is going to be an antiquarian run. So we're going to take a bunch of extra food because we don't really have any mm, like healers or anything. So this could get, a little, could get a little rough. We'll see what happens though. We're going to take some extra shovels. Let's see, two keys should be good. I'm trying to think what else we need. Probably some anti-venom. And we're about flat busted broke right now. Uh, take some torches. Uh-oh. Sell one shovel. Take a couple extra torches. I think this will get us through the run. Hopefully this isn't a colossal failure. I'm going to be hurting extremely badly for gold. And that would be really bad. So let's see what happens here. If the load screen will ever load, of course. Okay. There we go. Okay. I like the... I like the... Uh, map pattern we got going here it's i don't think I've, i don't remember seeing this one or maybe it's just been a long time this is a really weird one but i kind of like it and we got a bunch of bandits to deal with right from the get-go looks like a good old time let's start off with the protect me hopefully yeah the good shit hopefully we dodge a lot okay we're dodging the whole crap ton this is really good take out one of these guys if we can. That was a pretty crappy damage roll. Oh, that's not good. Alright, come on, game. Come on, game. Give me some good damage rolls. That's not enough. Alright, let's get some bleeds going here. Stop doing slice and dice. That's so annoying. Hit the flagellant. Hit the flagellant guys, like hit him harder. Like stop beating the crap out of the antiquarian. These guys are really annoying, I need to kill them. Man, I should have focused them first. The gunner guys aren't too annoying really to be honest. Um, seven damage. Let's just do this. If he bleeds, he'll die, he's dead. So is that guy, of course. Um. How much can I hit for? 7 to 15. 5 to 11. Let's go for the... Mm, wow, we rolled a crappy damage roll on that guy. That's unfortunate. Getting some sick AoE dodges, though. That's pretty nice. Okay, finally, someone that isn't the Antiquarian is not getting hit. Good. It's been a pretty crappy first encounter so far, but eh, what can you do? Not a whole lot. Pray that RNG Jesus is on your side. I kind of wish I took the heal on this guy so he could heal himself, but oh well. Not a whole lot I can do about it right now. Give this guy a little peek to the face action. Alright. Good amount of money from that fight. Not bad. Pop a torch here. Hope for the best. Oh gosh, tree guy. Oh, and switch my party around. Nice. All right. Well, at least I can get back into position here. Somewhat. I like kill that bitch. Uh, that's the priority number one. After getting this guard up, so this guy does not destroy me. Hmm. Not too worried about him being marked or him taking stress. It's not a big deal at all. Okay, mark this up. Let's see, let's go ahead and use a dog tree here, because I want to make sure this bitch is dead. I want to kill that one next. Obviously, I want this guy dead too, but, you know, one at a time. He has a lot of HP at her. Kill her first. Let's go ahead and drink an anti venom there. We do, you know, I did buy all those for a reason. Alright, good. She's dead. Now we just gotta deal with this asshole. We're going to continue to stack this on this guy so he has more prot and dodge. If he does get hit, well, we'll be able to heal her up. 
his heel. All right, eight damage, not too shabby. Not low enough to enable him to use his heal though. That's okay, it's not a big deal. Totally fine, as long as she has her protect me up, to we're totally fine. Oh, it just wore off, crap. I forgot it wears off when her turn comes up. That's unfortunate. Hopefully he hits the flagellant. He didn't hit the flagellant. That is not good. <laughs> I fucked up. Oh god. Okay. We might be camping after this. This will be the earliest camp ever. Not good at all. Hopefully the antiquarian is not dead here. That would be really bad. I don't know why she's going so late. Okay, how much health is this? Okay, he's dead. I don't know why I even bothered you to protect me. He's just dead. Alright. Good amount of gold drop there. So yeah, we're just going to go ahead and camp. This is a terrible start. Mistakes were made. Etc. You know, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Let's do that. Let's give her some health. That is not much health. Um, what do I want to do here? I guess we'll do that. We only got a few things left here. Um, a lot of resists are. I could do that. Hmm. What's his speed right now? Speed of eight. Hmm. Yeah, I'll take some more speed. Why not? And that just removes disease, which we don't have. Alright. Yeah, it does look bad, I agree. At least we can't get ambushed. Alright. Well, this is not good. Let's see here. I've had worse starts, though, to be honest. Oh, look at that. If this run fails, that alone will probably save us. Well, that and, you know, the huge amount of gold we've already found. Considering we just started. Oh, man, another one of these. Hooray. All right, now, if my antiquarian with her 11 speed could go next, that would be great. Because, yeah, I don't want her getting hit anymore. All right, very nice. I am not worried about this fight at all at the moment. In case he, um... In case this guy here uh, decides to shift my entire party and it shifts in really bad uh, positions, which could happen, but we'll see what happens. And of course, that's the first thing he does, but we did dodge it, so that's pretty nice. Dog should bleed to death on his turn. Nice little crit, nice, very nice. All right. Just keep piling up the damage and the dots and all that crap. Come on, use tree branch smackdown. Do it. Do it. Do it, you bitch. Yeah. Hit that flagellant. Or, you know, be terrible and get dodged. That's fine, too. Yeah, I'm kind of hoping the flagellant gets a little bit busted up at some point. That way you can heal my antiquarian up a little bit. But, yeah, that's whatever. Oh, and swing and a miss again. I'm sure third time's the charm and all that, but he's not going to have a third chance. He's kind of dead. All right, deeds. That's what we need. Unlock strong box. Of course, it's trapped because why not? Let's go ahead and pop anti venom. And continuing onward, and we're just. God, this runs is barely started, and this sucks. Good lord. I cannot stress enough how much this run sucks so far. But, you know, I'm at the mercy of the RNG right now. Alright. Let's use one of these anti thems on the tree here. Get some extra loot. And we don't need the blood, really. So we'll just let that go. And we got a treasure room, alright. 
Our antiquarian with her 11 or 10 speed. I thought she had 11 speed. Did she have less speed for some reason. Oh, because of the death death store recovery. That's why she has less speed. That's right. I forgot that was a thing. All right, that guy's destroyed. See if we can bleed that guy out, which we did. Can we one-shot this guy? Yes, we can. He's dead. He's dead. And we just got one enemy to deal with. We're just getting blighted by everything. I'm not too worried about that, though. Alright, if I kill this guy before he does anything, that would be great. Good stuff. All right, more deeds, very nice. More money, too. All right, where's my keys? There they are. More deeds, oh my gosh. We need deeds, like, so bad right now. Man, this is this is really nice. Um, question is, what do I want to drop for these deeds? Um, hmm. Not a lot of things we can drop. I guess we'll drop the, the herbal, whatever things there. Medicinal herbs. Forgot what they're called for a moment. Um, I will take these busts over the crest right now as well. Crests are just really common. I could use the busts, I'm sure. Let's see what we got in here. Just a little bit of gold. More antiques, though. Oh, we got a trap here. Let's go ahead and disarm that, get that crap out of the way. Don't need to step on that today, that's for sure. Well, let's give her a little bit of food. Might help her survive and stay away from death's door. Also, need to be popping these torches. Keeping this run safe. There's a food check. Yeah, I love looting these torches, antiquary, and just a free minor antique every time. Good stuff. Nature herself, a victim to the spreading corruption, malformed with mystic fear. Man, we're gonna run out of torches pretty soon. This could get rough. Hopefully, we don't run any more obnoxious battles. And hopefully, we don't run to the Shambler when we inevitably run out of torchlight. That would be bad. Oh, crappy little dodge there. Oh man, good little dodge there. Let's go ahead and use that biscuit. May one shot this guy. Nice. We will definitely one shot him with a crit. As beast, or I'm about to call him Beastmaster. How master uh, that ability I just used does da bonus damage versus beast by quite a bit. Can't remember the exact number. I just remember it's quite a bit. Let's see. Yeah, 30% damage bonus versus beast. That's what they are, obviously, so it's pretty nice. If I could kill this guy before he attacks the Aquarian, it'd be great. Good shit. Oh, wow. So much gold. Oh, my God. We're getting pretty lucky on the gold drops. And we got a map that didn't show us dick. That's great. Oh, wait, no, there it goes. I heard the uh, the sound cue for the uh, secret treasure room, but apparently I did not. That's whatever. All right, let's head back the way we came. I'm guessing there's only one more room battle left, but I don't know which room it's going to be in. That's just a guess. I don't know that for sure. Got another one of those rare antiques. It's pretty nice. Got to pop some torches. We got a trap at the end of the room here. We're doing pretty good. The game's not being too dickish anymore. At least for now. Probably just jinx myself, but whatever. Bring it on, game. Yeah, I'm gonna jinx myself some more, you know. Tempt the game to screw me over. I like to do that. All right, come on, good loot. Oh, nice, free anti venom. Let's go ahead and use that. Might as well. Also, I want the gold over something. I'm not sure what I want to exchange it for. Mm, 
I'm gonna hold on to the anti venom. I'm just gonna assume I'm not gonna find a treasure room, and we're gonna do that because odds are we'll find more gold, and gold stacks quite a bit when you have antiquarians. So yeah, you always wanna loot the gold when you have antiquarian. And we need to use our last shovel here. Hopefully there's no more blockages anywhere in the dungeon. Oh boy. Towering ectoplasm. Fun, fun, fun. Alright, let's kill this bitch in the back first. And I'm getting some pretty crappy damage rolls, unfortunately. Not too much I can do about that. Not too worried about any stress attacks on him. He'll be fine. Apparently he's marked now. Not really a big deal. Okay, that guy's gonna bleed, or not, by that guy, I mean that chick in the back, she's gonna bleed to death. I just gotta focus this guy down, and we're good. Let's see, he does have some protection. I need to remove that. Please don't resist. Good shit. Make it 25, very nice. Let's try blinding this guy. I don't do this very much, but since I uh, add debuff skill chance to this uh, trinket, we'll, we'll give it a try. Never been a big fan of that ability, but hopefully it works or it works out for us. And we haven't—he hasn't missed a single attack yet, unfortunately. But we'll stack it on there. See how it works out. Or maybe we'll just use protect me and be super safe because I don't trust RNG in this game to do me any favors. Usually does not. All right, big guys down. Another very rare antique. By very rare, I mean rare. I call them the very rare antique, and other labels rare antiques. But anyways, got another one of those. How much are these worth again? Twelve fifty. Of course, it's twelve fifty. All right, this is probably the last room battle, most likely. Let's go ahead and guard. It's kind of a nasty fight. I hate these damn things in the back. They're so annoying. Decent amount of prot. They got those dots they put on you. It's very annoying. All right, good. Yeah, mark that guy. That is exactly what I want. Let's get bleed on this dude in the back here. Very nice. Got some dodge that's going there. Good stuff. Get another bleed on him. Probably just gonna let this guy bleed out, most likely. You know what? I'm gonna hit him one time. That way he ins that ensures his demise. Yeah, he's dead now. Let's go ahead and remove the protection from this guy right here. Good stuff. He's marked as well. Uh-oh. He's gonna make some friends. By friends, I mean a friend, because it's just one. All right, let's go ahead and get Protect Me up to be super safe here. That will do bonus damage versus Mark, but I would rather take this guy out so I don't have to worry about any, you know, extra attacks from, uh, you know, extra dudes, you know. Just more risk, more RNG I have to worry about. I'd rather just have to worry about this guy. I forgot that ability stunned. Anyways, let's remove some of his accuracy, see how that works. So that's minus 15 accuracy. Let's see, this damage does extra damage against marked, so we'll go ahead and use that. Also gives us extra uh, accuracy, which is kind of nice. And he's focused on the antiquarian, not really a big deal. I think this is the last fight. Oh, I just noticed the mark wore off. I guess it doesn't matter, though, because I think the run is over. We got some more deeds. Holy shit. So many deeds. Bleeders, this trinket. Everybody has a free spot. That's what our... I'll exchange those for those. Um, yep. We're just going to ignore that tent. Not really worth my time, I don't think. So let's see how much gold we got. Hopefully we got around 30k. Let's see how much we got here. With that combined easily over 30k. So that's pretty nice. We get that good trinket. Everybody's still level 4. That's good. Alright. 
I want one disease to get rid of, too. No negative quirks. Overall, a pretty good run. A little rough at the start. But, you know, it's just how it goes sometimes. This chick had three diseases. That's the third one I'm getting rid of. Like, yeah, that bitch, that bitch had it rough. Anyways, that's going to be all for today's run. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I will see you all next time. Have a good one.